Hey everyone, um, I'm Connor again. Um, I'm sorry if I sound like a little sick. That's because I am. So, yeah, okay. So let's get back into it. So, we have now we have a fully um, sketched out part, right? And unfortunately, it's only in two dimensions, where it's the length and the width. But now we want the height. So like, how? So we can put it in the three dimensions. So in order to do that, we're going to confirm the sketch and then click up here or hit shift E to extrude and then select the sketch you want to uh, extrude, which just means to make it into a three dimension. And that's what it should look like. You can drag this arrow to increase the dimension or you can type up here like if I want 1.5 inches then boom there you go now you have a dimension apart with an extrude um yeah um so let's say you wanted to add something else on this so instead of adding an extrude you would remove an extrude so in order to do that you're gonna hit sketch again and then make a second part, which is going to be on top of here. You're, oh, I forgot. You're also selecting this face, that w meaning like that's where your sketch is going to be. So let's say you wanted to make a circle. You would like click wherever on the part you wanted the circle to be. So like, let's say I wanted it to be right in the center right there. And... Then let me dimension this by clicking up here, clicking the diameter of the circle, and having that be 0.25. Now it is 0.25 inches diameter, and let me confirm that. So now we have our normal part with a sketch on top of it. And let's say we wanted to have that hole remove that so we'd go back up to extrude click on the sketch and then instead of hitting add which adds material you're gonna hit remove and i mean it's already removing it through the entire part but let's say you wanted it to remove through the entire thing you would just click up here where it says blind and click through all so now that circle is being extruded removed throughout the entire part and there you go that's how you get a or that's how you add extrude and remove extrude through sketching